Buddies, it's Bad Lori, and I'm back with a huge patch to read to you today. This might actually be the biggest patch I've ever seen. It has a lot of actual new elements that it's adding into the base game, not just corrections for all the bugs. So between all the corrections that it actually did put into the game and the new base game elements, there's a lot to cover. So without further ado, let me read this patch to you. Sim Guru Graham posted to the Sims 4 latest patch notes. Update 11-10-2020 PC 1.68.154.1020 Mac 1.68.154.1220 Console version 1.33 Welcome Simmers! A relaxing getaway sure sounds nice right about now. We're inviting you to take a trip with your Sims to your favorite destination with newly added ability to vacation anywhere within The Sims 4. Here at Maxis, we'll be hitting the slopes of Mount Kobarevi with the release of The Sims 4 Snowy Escape in just a few short days. Curious how it works? Read on! We've got a big haul of new features and requested fixes in this major update to The Sims 4. Sim Guru Graham, Sim Guru Rusky. New and improved features! Platforms! Platforms enable you to build rooms at varying heights within a story level. As much as we'd love to sit here and go on and on about how incredible platforms are and how they completely revolutionize build mode, you'll see that for yourself as soon as you start to try them out in-game. Here are some basics about how they function and how you start building with them. You either can use the new platform tool directly in, or you can place preset platforms that come in various shapes and sizes. You'll find both of these within the walls and empty rooms section of build mode. You easily can add or adjust the height of the platform in any room. Simply click on a room and select it, and the new up and down arrows in the widget that appears will allow you to add or adjust the height of a platform within the space. Because platforms can have their height adjusted up or down, you can even and create platforms that sink down beneath the ground, like really, really deep down. I don't know why anyone would want to go do that, <coughs> devious players, <coughs> but there's options here. The ability to go deep is reserved for ground level and basements. You can stack platforms on top of 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 platforms. Seriously, go nuts. Get creative. Make something nobody's ever seen in The Sims before on top of platforms. When a platform's height is a single step higher or lower than the adjacent floor, Sims are able to step onto it. For anything higher than a single step, connecting a set of stairs or a ladder between the different sur surfaces will allow Sims to reach them. Here's your first advanced lesson in platforming. Remember that call out about stacking platforms on top of each other? If each stacked platform is a single step in height, you could certainly make some interesting custom staircases. One notable exception, platforms can't connect across multiple levels. If you build a stack of platforms all the way up to the ceiling, the very last step will need to be a staircase or a ladder to connect the two separate floors of a building together. Platforms can be utilized as fully functional space or be purely decorative areas. The choice is yours. As you adjust the height of a platform, your sims will intelligently adapt to that space. For example, you could create a platform with only enough head clearance for a child to enter. The possibilities are endless. The visual look of platforms can be customized in a variety of ways. The walls and empty rooms section of build mode now has a platforms trim subcategory. Here is where you'll find trims that match all of our foundations as well as some new trims with basic materials that look perfect in the interior of a building. Want to go even further? Try wrapping the edge of a platform with half walls and then customizing the edge with any other wall material. Mix and match these methods for creative results. Even more half walls. Speaking of half walls, we're pleased to share with you that we've created 12 additional half wall heights to choose from, adding to the seven heights previously available. One could factually say that this is our most sizable half wall update ever. Pity the poor person who was tasked with writing uniquely descriptive names for each of those 19 height variations. Sentiments. Sentiments are those special fuzzy feelings that form between sims when they share a memorable moment together. Shared experiences between sims now offer the opportunity for sims to develop long lasting sentiments between each other, which in turn affects how they feel and act in the presence of each other or absence of another particular sim. Unlike relationships between between sims, sentiments can be a one-sided affair. When two or more sims share an experience together, you may find that all, some, or none of them walk away with the, from that moment having formed lasting impressions of the other sims that were involved. The base game includes a wide variety of these sentiments, and Snowy Escape has additional ones tied to experiences within the pack. Sentiments that have formed between sims can be viewed in two locations. When socializing with another sim, click on the heart cover notebook that appears at the social UI at the top of your screen. 
Alternatively, you can view the sentiments that exist between two sims at any time within the new sim profile within the relationship panel. Read on for more information on this new sim profile. Sim Profiles Have you ever gone to check out the other sims in your sim's life only to be greeted with an overwhelmingly large tooltip that extended from the tippy top all the way to the bottom of your screen? We certainly have, and we weren't happy with it. There has to be a better way! And there is! Introducing Sim Profiles! Within the Relationship panel, you can now click on the portrait of any sim and select the Open Sim Profile for a full breakdown of all the info that the active sim knows about that sim. It even includes those new nifty sentiments everyone's talking about. Skin Tone Update Console and Community Identified Issues We saw your feedback about the October Skin Tones update and to improve clarity and transparency, we shared a first look on Twitter of the fix in progress. With this patch, the console game gets the October fixes for the texture compression resolving the banding within the cheeks and the foreheads as well as discoloration on the tip of the nose. In addition, this patch addresses the two community identified issue of red dots around the lips and a dark blotch between the eyes. The red dots around the lips should be completely resolved at this time. The dark blotch between the eyes was softened to remove the hard edge, but the darkening is expected as part of the shadowing around the nose. Vacation anywhere? Couldn't we all use a good vacation rate about now? Your sim certainly could, and now they can go anywhere! The ability to go on a vacation to any of your worlds has been added to the game for all players along with the rental lot type. To vacation to a world, a rental lot must exist within it. Should you've purchased Snowy Escape, you'll find the residential world of Mount Komorebi includes some pre-built rental lots, a ready getaway awaiting your sims. If you prefer to vacation in another world, Sulani anyone? You'll first need to enter Manage World Mode and update at least one of the lots within the desired world to become a rental lot. During a vacation, if your sims are lacking any necessities, they now can order supplies now from the rentals mailbox or from their phone. Happy travels! Toddler slippers! We figured it would be nice to give toddlers a pair of slippers to wear, so we did! Cozy Feet! S-Pop Radio Station You may remember S-Pop, short for Sim Pop, as a radio station in the City Living Expansion Pack. While the music tracks that originally came with that station will remain exclusive to City Living, the station itself will now be available for all players with five new songs for all to enjoy. Keep On Rocking, performed by Chai. Kanzen Hugi Senjin, Simlish Version, performed by Nanawaraki. Part 2, performed by Sasuki. Ninursak's Tone, performed by Unite Satisfy. Heru Jion, performed by Yaosobi. And now, on to the fixes. The Sims 4. Freelancer Sims can now complete gigs they have signed up for and harvest the fruits of their labor. Simoleons, 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 simoleons! Does your Sim look bored all the time? Even when you think they're having fun? Not a problem anymore. It's been taken care of. Calls dropping? Is your cell phone behaving like a certain network is just not up to snuff? We have upgraded all sims to Simgilair, Llama's choice network that does not allow off the grid shenanigans when your sims are not off the grid. The nano can touchless trash can has been recalled and fixed, so now all your trash can be cash in a flash! Did you ever experience the honey I shrunk the basil and sage plants issue in game? No longer! No sage or basil plants were harmed in the fixing of this issue. Ever had sims show up looking like a product of a bad makeover? Did your debate judge just show up to the debate wearing a mascot hat when they're not the mascot? Did your fellow spellcaster show up in the magic realm wearing not so magical clothes? Say no more. We've applied the fix so that non-playable sims can be a bit more appropriately coordinated in their outfits per the occasion. To explain a bit further, we created a much more robust set of internal tools that allows us to have a greater control over the outfits that the Sims choose to wear in unique situations. We've improved a lot of the wacky towny fashion you've previously seen. It's called Fashion Sweaty, look it up. But if you still see oddities, let us know. It'll be an easier issue for us to iron out moving forward. Together we can defeat the dreaded eyeball ring. Door lock settings now persist when Sims travel. That's right, if I disallow everybody, it should stay that way when I travel, or when I exit the game, or the occasional restart too! Hmph! Sims who have passed away no longer sometimes disappear from their genealogy. This is not retroactive, so any sims that have already disappeared will not return. Sims no longer ignore the kitchen sink and dishwasher to wash their dishes in the bathroom sink, okay? Oasis Springs world map now shows lots in the correct locations. I see you, Yuma Heights! Don't be sneaky now! 
Sims now can propose to their beloved without rejection. Congratulations! On the same note, Sims with multiple romantic partners can now propose and marry one of them and not get sabotaged by their partner's predicament of not being able to get married because they are employed together, even though they are not. Sims who have finished their workday now get back to things sooner instead of sometimes staring off into space. Ever wished your delicious food just never ended? We thought we did until our Sims were unable to finish their meals. Now they are able to finish eating leftovers. They are leftovers, not left forevers. Sims sharing double beds can now nap or sleep in any combination. Sim A can nap and Sim B can sleep, or Sim A can sleep and Sim B can nap, or they can both sleep or nap. Well, you get the picture. Shower tubs can now be cleaned enough to be visibly squeaky clean. Another one bites the dust. The issue that generated error code 110-C875-D8FF on game load has been fixed. Style influencer sims can now perform quick sketch impressions without breaking the digital sketch pad. Be kind with your tools and toys. In the same fashion, we made sure unflirty sims no longer receive the witness crass act moodlet when parents and children hug or kiss cheeks. Adult sims now teach blocks to their toddlers. Learning in early life is important. Sims on vacation can now hire a nanny and or a butler to take care of things while they are away. Toddlers no longer will show as at daycare when they are taken back home via the care for self option. No toddler clones here. You can't be two places at once. Toddlers left at home while the rest of the household goes on vacation now receive proper care and otherwise can enjoy the vacation. Think of the children. Toddlers deserve fun and relaxation in new places too. Toddlers no longer get the silly ocean moodlet from playing in rivers. Children once again can earn adult skills. <laughs> they grow up so fast. Simmers and social events will now get a warning when switching to a sim in another neighborhood rather than the event canceling automatically. Sims with enough simoleons now can move into empty lots. Splitting households and then moving no longer causes an infinite load. We told Sims that they should probably not take 45 minutes to drink a single cup of coffee. As you guys know, I am a coffee fiend, but nursing the same cup of coffee that long is not in the coffee lover's manual for enjoying a fresh cup of coffee. We met with our wonderful Sim firefighters and came to the agreement that now they will also extinguish fires on wall objects such as paintings. Action progress bars are no longer interrupted when a new action is added to a Sims queue. Sometimes items could disappear from your Sims inventory after traveling. This should no longer happen. Where is my cup of coffee? Oh, okay, it is here. Sims no longer have clay blobs, future cubes, and or sketch pads spawn infinitely in their inventory. This felt like grabbing something out of Felix the Cat's bag. Just never ending bag of clay blobs, future cubes, and sketch pads. What did it all mean? We may never know. Opening a stack of inventory items and then going back now highlights the correct item. In reviewing items in the inventory, we realized that some items stacked were showing up the number 99 plus incorrectly on the multi-select. What's the number? Stomp, stomp. What's the number? Stomp, stomp. The number of the day. You're about to see the number is the actual number of the items you have. Ah ha ha ha. That's the number of the day. Sims no longer endlessly play games such as chess, sabak if you own Journey to Batu, Void Critter cards if you own kids stuff, and your regular card games. I could play with Medusa forever though. Hashtag Medusa forever. The aspiration panel now shows the gender of the sim regardless of whether they are active. Now, only gardeners autonomously remove wild plants. Sims with green fiend trait, if you own eco lifestyle, were being a bit overly eager in removing plants everywhere. So the professionals will handle it from now on. Listen to together on a stereo no longer resets Sims. Sims no longer get poorly decorated and dismally decorated moodlets when decorations are in the room. This applies to new saves as it is not retroactive, but my, how judgmental lots were. Columns now can rotate 45 degrees and in free rotation, spin them right round, centers right round. The live edit objects cheat no longer surfaces items with broken thumbnails that were not meant to be part of that cheat. Pardon our dust. Shower descriptions in the catalog said they were uncomfortable. Showers are meant to relax and be a place of meditation, so now the catalog says they provide discomfort relief, unless the specific shower really is uncomfortable. The Subtle Saucer and the Super Subtle Saucer now have images that are more distinct from each other in the catalog. Super Subtle Super Saucer removed the Player Feet's door because it really wasn't a door. 
Dishwashers, the professional dish laborer, Washer Pro Freestanding Dishwasher from Dine Out, and Industrial Dishwasher Unit from Parenthood no longer have a gap between counters. Digital world wall tiles have been polished, shiny and new. Career unlockable outfits no longer show up when filtering for custom content. Toddlers no longer have bald spots when zoomed out on low graphic settings. Frayed jean, YM bottom underscore EF13 jeans frayed crop underscore black, no longer clips with several tops. Anniversary t-shirts, YF top underscore EF05 shirt T anniversary and YM top underscore EF05 shirt T anniversary fit better on more body types. Sims with certain feminine frames now look better when wearing pants or full body outfits. Fix some create a sim item backgrounds. Selecting what you want to do next at the end of the tutorial on console no longer has the mysterious world label in the background. Gallery filters no longer cut off some venue type names in some languages. This was particularly egregious for French and Brazilian Portuguese text. Game fonts got some spiffing up to keep all characters looking their best. As with every update, the localization team has tweaked, improved, and fixed text across all packs and previous updates. Get to work! Scientist sims placing collected crystals and metals in their laboratory no longer crash the game. Do you ever science so hard the simulation crashes? The test serum action on a scientist coworker no longer causes an error. Get together. Stone frame window. Window 1x1 underscore EP02TUD stone frame 2 title underscore set 1. Holy geometry. Window 1x1 underscore EP02TUD low underscore 03 underscore 2 tile set 1. And King of Diamonds classical door. Door single 2x1 underscore EP02TUD high 3 tile underscore set 1. Now place properly. Sims and clubs with a read rule now finish the books they choose to read. No cheating, my friends. Wearing their earbuds, if you own fitness stuff, and participating in club gatherings no longer causes an error. Club affiliation on university housing, if you own Discover University, now persists even after entering build buy mode. City living. Ultra speed now works while festivals are in progress. Some conspiracy can be said about festivals wanting simmers to enjoy them in all their glory, at normal speed, at every speed, but these are just conjectures, yes. Sims no longer read their mail aloud while conversing with their apartment neighbors. Talk about rude, right? Read About Festival now consistently displays festival information. Sims from specific San Myshuno neighborhoods now have more variety on their appearance. Cats and Dogs Stencils and Create a Sim Pet now consistently paint your furry friends without crashing. Seasons the holiday tradition, New Skill Day, now focuses on starting new skills and improving low-level skills, so skills that are maxed out don't count. Toddlers who are inside during a blizzard and in a high chair no longer want to run inside, so their caretakers won't take them out of their chair prematurely. You are safe, little one. You are safe. Now all onions, carrots, mushrooms, potatoes, apples, tomatoes, and grow fruits can be planted indoors during freezing weather. Plants no longer change their quality or evolve on their own after the Sims traveling. Some outdoor plants that were stuck in summer fall now turn brown and lose their flowers when winter starts. Sims can now book vacations on computer during holidays. Simmers who have disabled rain and snow no longer should see them during mysterious weather. Mysterious indeed. Male sims now wear appropriate shoes when working as a floral designer or a botanist. The beanie hat, CU hat underscore EP05 beanie palm, now looks a bit better. Sims scheduling an event in the calendar for a rental lot no longer end up in a lot where they no longer have been greeted. Get famous. Stands, stalker fans, and kleptomaniac sims no longer steal pet food bowls or cat litter. I have no words for this one. I have nothing. Sims with maxed out atrocious reputation now maintain their reputation when traveling. Atrocious you shall be forever. Island living. Conservationist sims now write conservation articles at the appropriate career level, level four. On the same note, the task for research conservation can now be completed. Odd jobs no longer get stuck in a state where inventory and build mode cannot be accessed. We had long conversations with the island celebration participants and agreed that no random sim should enter a sim's home without permission. 
barging in as if they owned the place. Excuse you, privacy and property are a thing you know. Discover University. We chatted with the registrar at Brightchester University and got them to agree that students should receive class time reminders before the class time starts instead of after. You're welcome. Now make sure you go on time, all right? School Spirit Day no longer schedules multiple instances at the same time. But did you know it's School Spirit Day? Club gatherings no longer have Sims with their bikes indoors in a disruptive manner. Sims traveling long distances, including stairs, now properly walk the stairs and then hop their bikes and they don't leave their bikes behind. You can't just abandon your bicycle. What about the poor thug's feelings? Sims now properly get off bikes while on a slope. Lawyer Sims now file court documents as their tasks dictate after levels of five. Just because you move up doesn't mean you stop filing docs. Students in a different neighborhood from their university now go to school instead of work when choosing to go to class from a career panel. Students now can receive only one merit scholarship per term. Sims are no longer listed as being at university when they are at home. The game no longer sometimes freezes when Sims enroll in university. We get that attending university is life-changing, but freezing a game is taking it to a bit extremes. Students can now return to campuses in their leisure time to cloud gaze and play soccer in the surrounding areas of Brightchester and Foxbury Institute, respectively. Sims jogging in exo mech suit no longer get fatigue-related moodlets. For eco-lifestyle simmers, throw away and compost are now available in piles of discarded food. The consequences of not having these were especially egregious in the university dorms. Sweatpants, YF bottom underscore EP08 loose sweatpants, now looks better when paired with scarf, YF top underscore EP08 sweater scarf, in Create a Sim. Eco Lifestyle Recycle Disciple Sims without the kleptomaniac trait now swipe household objects less often. We get it, we are all trying to do the best for our environment, but going after your dumpster was a bit too far. We kind of need that. Eco footprints no longer change very quickly from green to neutral. Knox rejoices. Eco footprints in worlds no longer become neutral when entering managed worlds. We had a chat with eco inspectors and they agreed that they should display the correct occupation from now on. And they shall be known as eco inspectors forever. Bulldozing Pinecrest apartments now is possible without damaging the lot. Harvestables obtained via the dumpster no longer disappear from inventory a few minutes later. Easy come, easy go, would you not disappear though? Recycling is a wonderful thing. Recycling for inventory exposed missing text on some grand meals, so we filled in those names. Toddlers living in lots with reduce and recycle lot trait maybe were taking it a bit too far generating trash piles in their inventory. Put that down, no more trash in your pockets. Did your floor patterns experience a glow that never went away after selecting all of them? That's not a problem anymore. The wallpaper formerly known as Sheet Standing Seam 01 Gen has been renamed Corrugated Metal. The Fabricator's Fabricated Couch No Dye recipe now creates the correct item. Residential Wall Speaker is renamed Venue Wall Speaker Americana to accurately reflect its function and music. Venue wall speaker Americana now looks correct with the neutral wood option. Women's sandals, YF shoes underscore EP09 platform sandals now look better than when paired with jumpsuit, YF body underscore EP09 jumpsuit utility. Men's hairstyle, YM hair underscore EP09 curly bun black and YM hair underscore EP09 crimped long black have cleaner hairlines now. Dine out. Sims no longer get up from their seats at restaurants randomly to create chaos by speaking to other patrons, grabbing food from their table, putting it somewhere else, and taking it all over the place, and playing the piano, or singing. But it was quite the show, wasn't it? Xbox One Simmers now can edit restaurant staff uniforms in build mode along with other Simmers. Vampires. Vampire Spar no longer negatively affects conflict resolution for Simmers with Parenthood. Realm of Magic Spellcasters with all spells learned and maxed out no longer lose those when downloaded from the library slash gallery. Muscle memory, perhaps? Create a Sim no longer has the less than attractive skin type that was only intended for cursed Sims as an option. Spellcasters have reviewed the terms of always transportally spell and can now actually teleport anywhere, even places with stairs. Journey 2 but 2. Sims are now able to complete first order or resistance missions and then choose the hope versus order, first steps aspiration, and complete all goals. 
The lightsaber collection plaque now has a proper name and description so you can display it with pride. The First Order sent a memo stating to change the First Order blast door to not accept any decals or wall decorations. Create a sim asset YF bottom underscore GP09 villager patch vertical now goes better with different styles of shoes across multiple packs. The career panel now displays the active mission chosen from the mission panel. The game no longer freezes when sims freshen up at the dwelling at Black Spire Outpost. Luxury Party Create a sim asset YF body underscore SP01 sleeves flutter underscore solid brown fits better when wearing get to works YM hair underscore EP01 long wavy swept platinum hairstyle. Movie Hangout Movie night has been reclaimed. Sims can now watch complete films from start to finish without getting stuck in a never ending loop. Or should I say a never ending story? Story. Nifty knitting. Create a sim boots. CU shoes underscore SP17 boots buckled underscore solid red pin. Work better with jeans. CF bottom underscore SP07 jeans print underscore floral blue LT. Well buddies, that's everything I have for you from this patch update. I can't wait to get in the game and test drive some of this stuff for myself, like player profiles and platforms. Anyway, I'm going to go play The Sims. Thanks so much for staying through the entire video. I love you so much, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!